Well, when asked to describe what foster care is like, many children will often answer bad and good, largely depending on their foster parents. Today's Wednesday's child described it as a roller coaster, and then he said something heartbreaking. I hope it leads one of you watching to adopt this child because if anyone needs love, it's my new friend, Brandon. 15 year old Brandon has always had a connection with animals. I love animals, horses, cows, dogs, you name it, I love them. Brandon relates to animals because he says when you've been in foster care as long as he has, it begins to feel like you're in a cage. Do you feel locked up sometimes? Yes, ma'am. Brandon has grown up in foster care. I've been in foster care since I was two years old. His entire life, Brandon has had to trust a revolving door of strangers to give him a bath, send him off to school and raise him. So you can understand why he told us this. I kind of sometimes wish I can trade places with an animal. Brandon is extremely intelligent with a personality that melts your heart. Like anyone in need of love and family, Brandon just wants to go home. Do you want someone to fall head over heels for you? Yes, ma'am. I would love for somebody to fall head over heels for me. Brandon carries around these two pictures of himself from when he was little as a daily reminder that he's a survivor. I've been in foster care for a long time. How does that make you feel? A sad, kind of angry, yet forgiving. Brandon is thankful to God for his life and is beyond grateful for every ounce of attention and affection he receives. Go ahead and ask Susan what you need from her. I could actually use a hug. In a perfect world, Brandon would wake up to a forever family tomorrow morning, preferably with a house full of love and not. dogs. Just the basics, just need somebody that will love me, take care of me, and come to me when I need them. Just someone who can be there for me when I need comfort and someone I can be there for when they need comfort. A big thanks to Dr. Barton and the entire staff at Heal Veterinary Hospital. You must be licensed in the state of Texas to adopt a child. For more information on Brandon, go to WFAA.com slash Wednesday's Child.